beavers, not milk! No beavers, not milk! Protesters today in Mosinee speaking out against the governor's decision to extend safer at home. That's one of many protests against stay-at-home orders happening across the country today, breaking federal guidelines and advice from health experts while pushing for states to reopen. News 9's Amanda Lajeski was at the rally. She joins us with what happened. Hundreds of residents from all over the Badger State came together to peacefully protest against Governor Evers extending his safer at home order with one goal in mind to reopen Wisconsin. These buildings can't stay empty. You, can you imagine what the, the, the rent is there a month? As COVID-19 sweeps the country, businesses, farmers, families, and so much more are impacted. My business is just put on hold indefinitely as it stands. I'm a handyman and I had a hardwood floor. And I was setting it up, I was getting samples and all this, and the guy called me and said, oh, put it off until whenever. No beavers, not milk! No, no beavers, not milk! Last week, Governor Evers announced an extension to his safer at home order, leaving Wisconsin closed until May 26th. Protesters say that's why they gathered, breaking federal health guidelines to speak out against the governor. But we can't wait that long. It's like holding your breath underwater. You can only hold your breath so long. We've learned a lot of lessons in the last couple of weeks, and I think we got to move on because People need to work and eat. I think just having a group like this shows people that they're not alone. Nearly a thousand people gathered to air their frustrations about that decision. I feel like uh, we can't do this much longer. I feel like time's up. Pushing politicians to reopen Wisconsin. We got to get something moving. And if, if people can stay away from each other and work, I don't see why we should have to stay home. In his most recent press conference, we asked Governor Evers his thoughts on the rally. I understand the, their frustration, but this gives us all a chance to flatten the curve, make sure we, that we have these preconditions set in place that the, these several governors agreed on, and that will give time also for businesses to prepare what it's going to be like when they do reopen. Protesters just hoping Governor Evers hears them out. I hope that they see the concern that people have for our, our society. Event organizers encouraged protesters to continue social distancing and wear masks. But as you saw in the video, many decided against that. In the studio, Amanda Lojeski, News 9 WAOW.